Howdy folks, um, I finished my uh, my carbon and magnesium uh, earth battery. Um, I just got the magnesium in the mail today and uh, filled it up with dirt, and plugged that in the top, and uh, and the results are quite quite impressive. Um, I think uh, certainly a lot more impressive than the than my first battery of the. Uh, the zinc and the copper. Um, yeah, so uh, bear in mind that these were originally designed to be buried in the ground. Um, so you got, I'm, I'm guessing there'd be a lot more current um, running through the ground, um, and you're also spe supposed to set them up facing north and south. Um, and, but just for uh, just for test purposes. Um, I'm just doing this in a, in a little piece of uh, PVC pipe uh, glued to a piece of wood. Uh, so I got my uh, got my multimeter uh, set on uh, amps, milliamps, 20 amps. Uh, as you can see, there's nothing else hooked up to this thing. Uh, there we go. So we're getting uh, almost 0.9 milliamps. Uh, I think, from memory, uh, this earth battery was only, I think I was only getting about um, like 0 0.1 milliamps, uh, point one point, uh, sorry, point one five milliamps. Um, so this one's certainly putting out a lot more current uh, than the original. Um, now in here we've just got um, the design is to use carbon, uh, like a carbon grounding rod, and then a magnesium grounding rod. Um, I'm not sure originally how far, I think you're supposed to put them about 10 feet apart in the ground. Um, this one here is obviously it's only about an inch apart. Um, I used carbon fiber just because I had that uh, lying around in my shed. Uh, so I lined the bottom of this and the sides um, with the carbon fiber. And I just have a just a piece of steel wire. Um, that's just tucked down in between the PVC pipe and the carbon fiber and then uh, I just use that to connect my uh, leads to. So I'm just going to switch this over to volts DC 20 0.65 volts 64 volts so that's it's actually gone down from when I first put it in there um, it was up to about 1.9 when I f very first tested it uh, which I thought was quite high um, um, it might be losing its charge uh, maybe it's drawing the the uh, protons and neutrons, or whatever they are called, out of the dirt quicker than than the original battery. I'm not sure. Um, time will tell. All right, keep tuned. <laughs> 